Well, you can see the intermission now, which means that hopefully the camera isn't showing too much because it's probably showing more than just up to the intermission at near the top of the game. Hopefully it's not showing too much, but anyway. Loading. <coughs> Mountain cycles? They're apparently all over this world. And people are excavating space air machines like mobile suits from them apparently. So yeah, where Mickey showed up recently is probably also. Yeah, I think it's a mountain cycle. Captain Otter's men sang to the Islanders come near here to check out mountain cycle in a place nearby. Go Kingsley, Friday. You know, stop doing that. Captain, would it be alright if we joined them in the investigation? Mountain cycle investigation, huh? Yes, my good Telbinet will find some answers there regarding the world end up in its current state. We still need to learn why Mecha Beasts have started appearing now too. Might be able to find a lead and how to get back to our own world too. If we were to get out the Iron Gear, it's much more likely we'll get dragged into fights we want nothing to do with. Mecha Beasts appear in mankind and mo- Appear in Marked Mount where it's no longer safe to say there's nothing to do with us. And eventually there's the climat there's the climatic ultimate warrior battle. <laughs> and so on. Lieutenant Quattro, let's head for the mountain cycle of Kingsley Valley. Captain. <laughs> Our goal is to find scattered people and return to our own time. For that reason we need all the information we can get. Let's assume there is a way for us to get back to the space era now. Okay, so this flying battleship called the Argama is gonna work with us. <laughs> yep, this gives us access to all kinds of technology. You seem pretty happy with this Katsu. I can upgrade this this iron gear so it's best to move us and just punching stuff. Of course, my main line of work is as a technician. How long will it take us to get to Kingley? In our two hours or so. By the way, miss, if, mind if I pay the Argama a quick visit? <coughs> the Argama? What for? The Argama guys want to check out the white doll. I want to be there for that too. Go control the iron gear. Slap man, you handle it, it's all yours. Couldn't Delche do that? Fat man. <laughs> Maybe I should drop by to take Sir Gwen a visit. What's the deal, Rag? Whatever happened to stealing the iron gear? I've had up to here we're getting dragged into Eltry's fights. I'm starting to miss life on the old dusty trail. Oh, hello everyone. What are you doing here? Guys, you the same thing. Where are you going? I'm going to Sir Gwen and teach him more about culture. You're the captain, aren't you? I'm oh, sorry, can't you leave your station? Culture and art won't put food on the table, you know. That's my business. Ah. Uh, I just heard it look a lot more bright green in the recording than it actually is. More light, really. Hold it! What? Wake up and smell the coffee already! It smells horrible, I tell you. <laughs> I said I wanted to dedicate my life to culture, didn't I? You're still going on about that? Civilized people don't resort to violence. You do well to learn that. <laughs> you call a speedy knife draw civilized? Aren't you the violent one here? Huh, LJ Cargo? I suppose so. I'm often of, of an aggressive type like than you, truthfully. That's okay, so I work my hardest. You are trying to be in captain? No way. Oh, that's too bad. If you took over captain duties, I could devote more time studying culture. <laughs> I don't the captain is you! <coughs> hey Rag, why'd you show that offer down? There's no contest, not between me and Hor, and all she thinks about the culture. 
Well, Aston, I had not figure out now. <laughs> I couldn't spot any fusion reactor in this white doll. It doesn't have a generator. So I went what I meant, but it was a propulsion system different from ordinary MS. No wonder there's so much extra space in its main body. The shell section can hold an entire missile launcher. So the white doll really is just a mother robot suit? Yup, it's all just my conjecture. But there are beam like rays which run across the subs of the machine. The machine itself seems to be moved based on their expansions and contracts and it all seems to be capable of producing an eye field barrier, so it might be a practical use of it. What's this eye field thing? Special type of field which uses Minovsky particles to disperse electromagnetic waves. Ah, I get it. So that's what gives light bullets and light source their shape. That's all quick, don't you? Um, there is one thing that caught my notice. What's what? What's what's what? Somebody what's that? The white doll seems to repair wounds it takes out in battle itself. Yeah, it looks like it uses nano machines on the armor or something. Nano machines? Robots the size of molecules. They can be used for medical treatment. And produce machines on a microscopic level. Just think of them as cells or viruses. Depending on how they're used, they can, they can even be used to perform genetic alterations. So the white doll probably is now machines to repair damage in battle to a certain extent. So that's some amazing technology. Well, I personally find the technology behind walk machines. <coughs> which allowed them to run on gasoline to be way more impressive. Clear drive system and nano machine enhanced armor, the white doll's technology. At the very least, this is technology from our time. <coughs> Even if it was made in the future beyond the space here, was the moon race to build it or the innocent? And why was it hidden inside a statue like Lauren says? The white doll leaves too many unanswered questions. I don't even know the full extent of what I can do yet. This MS were to unleash the full capabilities, what would happen? Well, it would never defeat Shin, Gita, Robo. Lieutenant Armour, though? Lord, I'm interest interested in the White Doll, too. If anything not happens, let me know. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Well, I'll take care of the adjustments from now on, so you can focus on pilots in it. At any, no. At any rate, we've moved all the dirt that was caked inside of its ties. <laughs> yeah, there's turned out to be vein segments in the back of its legs. That might improve the white doll's performance, Lauren. You don't seem to enjoy fighting. It's not the same for all of you, Lieutenant. Lieutenant Amuro. There's Daniel on board the ship who enjoys fighting, including me. We trust that by fighting, we change something. Yes, just like you. Lieutenant Tamara. We might just be strangers to you and everyone on the Iron Gate, but <laughs> I hope you can trust us. Yes, sir. We should be in Kimsey by now. Let's start investigating, shall we? Alright, lend a hand. I've done mining work in the past, so I think it could help. Oh, yeah, that's handy. This is the Kingsley Mountain Cycle. Le Legend has a space-faring ship is buried here! A space-faring ship like the Argama? Yeah, but we can find that it'd be a huge benefit to the militia! For small boss suits and mecha beasts in our spaceship, the sky's the limit here, huh? We have to... Well, we have to do the digging. Hey, Missy. Missy. <laughs> Don't worry, we've got the perfect robot for the job. You do? Yeah, get our lighter. Oh, that mechanical doll the drill hand? <laughs> Sis, where are you going? I don't want to get in the way of the work going on, so I'm going to take a little walk. What? Uh, yeah. Gone blind. <laughs> Sis, you've been acting kind of strange lately. Did something happened to you? Kingsley, here long ago I once. Hey, who are you guys? This is my land. What are you doing? Roar! <gasps> you're, 
Will Kane! So Will Kane, it's really you! Do, do who, who might you be? I'm Diana Sorrel. Diana? Diana. Will! Will! Diana Sorrel. Diana Sorrel, te. Diana Sorrel. Wasn't Diana Sorrel, uh. I'm very rude. I mistook you for someone I knew. I do beg your pardon. Hmm? Who's this person you know? A will game in Albany, in the Kingsley region. <laughs> That's a good one. I'm certainly will game. But the game fa family mansion has been in Albany since the time of the founder of the family, the first will over a century ago. Over a century ago? How'd you even know whether I resembled the founder or not? Er, well. So you've heard stories ever since I was a child of the game family. <coughs> who took in a woman who came from the moon. <coughs> I wonder if, if you might not be that very will. Even if I was, I'm out here digging holes and... Miss Keyhill, there you are. Lily was calling for you. She said you wanted your help preparing, preparing for lunch. Laurent, Giron, and Chiru. Lady, who's this? Will get him. I do a sex of eight around these mine rooms. I'm Lauren Sehak. I'm in the care of the Heim family. Pardon me for not introducing myself sooner. I am Kihel Heim. Heim? The mining factory in the vicinity? In Glesser? Yes, sir. Ah, now I get what Lay took an interest to me while I was just, when I was just digging a hole. What is it you're trying to dig up? I'm just a diary of an old ancestor of mine's elite. <laughs> an ancestor? Do you mean the first world game? <laughs> yeah, that's right. A family has searched for generations for a spaceship, said to be sleeping within this mountain. <laughs> a spaceship? Well, we've seen, we're seen by the villagers six centuries. Because of that, the first several years I searched for the spaceship, I had to do it alone. Wow, that's some tough work you're doing. And did you find it? Sure did, you guys were looking for it too, right? Sid's story was true. This is something my family has spent long years searching for, though. I can't over hand it over to you guys. Um, why did I want to go spaceship to begin with? For what reason? That's... The moon. You want to go to the moon? Huh? <laughs> Good guess. I've ended up digging up for the militia due to the time suddenly changed. But the truth is, I want to meet the woman my forefather loved, Diana Sorrel. Wow, how romantic. Will Kane, you are not him, but you have certainly inherited his blood. This place bears the smell of the King's Valley, where I spent time with Will. <coughs> Take my story seriously? Most people here either scoff or call me a liar. Uh, I have trouble enough just believing that people even live on the moon. Will Kane, please put your story. Lady Diana of the Moon once ascended to the Earth. I just gotta say Diana. Lady Diana of the Moon once ascended to the Earth. She stayed for a time with the game family in the Manian Alban, Albany. There, she had Will the First. And they fell in love. Hold on, she wrote the story wouldn't end that simply. Right, other men had fallen in love with the Princess of the Moon as well. She addressed this issue, the Princess issued the men a guest. She told him to bring her a treasure, told of in folklore across the world. A feather from the phoenix of Eastern legend, right? <laughs> yes, the phoenix feather. A fairy tale, famous in the southern part of North America. And what became of Will? Will the first died in action while journeying in search of that treasure. What a downer. Miss Kehel, what's the matter? Your face is all pale. I had to board the ship, picking me up before Will could return, so I never knew. When I returned to the moon, I was caught up in dealing with government, governmental affairs. <laughs> All the problems that cropped in my, in my absence. Just as things began to settle down, I went into artificial hibernation. Is that all I can do as Queen? Miss Kiha, what could be wrong with her? She's different from usual. So, did you manage to secure the spaceship? No, sir, we'll refuse to ask to do digging there. But, sir, that spaceship is buried there? Yes, sir. Astonish. 
found a huge amount of reason there when he checked. Comes down to it, I have to ask their government crew for help, and resort to drastic measures. Now I don't want to make the situation any worse, so we can avoid it. Let's talk over with Mr. Will one more time tomorrow. If I turn to the soul I'll be able to take Will to the moon. Wish was, but my wish was to live here with that man. Who is it? Whoops, sorry did I scare you? Will game. <coughs> I came to tell you goodbye. You took my story seriously. Goodbye? Yeah, the militia men want to use my, my spaceship for war. That happens, I won't be able to go to the moon. So I decided to sell the spaceship to someone else. You didn't sell it to... Yes, to Diana Counter. Since they came from the, come from the moon, they'd probably know how to make it run, too. You mustn't! Right now, Diana Counter sees you as black history relics for war. What gives you the right to claim that? Er, uh, well... I've already made my decision either way. I've got more chance with them than I would working with the militia. Wait a moment. <coughs> In all to my life stream are two different things. I put everything on the light to realize will the first stream. Is this how Will Games' bloodline always is? Will journeys against my wishes. My feelings are ever so slightly misplaced. If I had made contact with that counter, it could ruin his life more so. Let's stall him. <coughs> Will Game. Okay. Now you think this over again? Are you going to get in the way of my dream too? No, right now the moon you seek to visit is trying to start a war with the Earth. What would Will the Forest and the Queen of the Moon think of a situation like this? Well, what you seek to do could add more fuel to the fire. Before chasing your own dream, take once more upon what your ancestor must have felt. Alright, what you says what you say makes sense. Thank you for hearing me out. Sure, I can put a rain check on my dream until the war is over. I wouldn't want to end things the way that might that grieve my forefather and the princess. I should do all that I can to to I should do all I can I can to ensure that it never happens. I'll try speaking with Gwen once more tomorrow. Alright. Good night, Will the game. May tomorrow treat you well. Yeah, good night. Sorry, miss. I don't think I can wait until the day this war ends. Episode 19, A Century's Love. I guess this chapter's all about Will Gamu. Or episode, whatever you want to call it. Episode, scene, level, mission. Chapter. Yada yada. Good morning, Captain. Good morning, so is Masaki still not come back? No, he's still appeasing around somewhere. I should have told you, Ensign Yoraki, go out and look around for him. Captain, we've got something approaching the ship! What? Enemies! You can always tell from the music. So that, yeah, it's where we've got the strike home. Yeah. You're not a good bat bat master, it's a good point. It's true there's a spaceship buried in this mountain cycle? It's true, the militia have uh, been trying to confiscate it. What is he in a Zamel? <coughs> What's that white ship? Is the innocence? I've heard nothing about it. It came with the militia, belongs to a group I don't recognise. Will you try to lead me into a trap? Uh, of course not. I let you hear that the militia wouldn't get the spaceship. Plus, the other character is much more advanced. You improved the doll I dug up. If you dug that up, there was plenty more MS where it came from. Which means we can do some malicious forces to a lot men our own. Alright, secure this mountain cycle. Push all the malicious machines. It's enemy attack. I can draw on the earth and send them out. I had to figure out position so fast. <laughs> it must have been. We'll get 
Volte V. Pureto Mazinga. Etter. Mazinga. Toggy. Milan. Umbra. Quattro. Tirol. Burning. Move out! Will game, do you understand? To play my spaceship and go to the moon, I'll do whatever it takes. <gasps> that mobile suit. Will game is right, me. We can't just call him Will, can we? <laughs> yeah, you're right. What's he doing with the moon, man? <laughs> Don't you defer my Romax. I'm using the spaceship to call me Diana. She's very close now. <coughs> Diana's right in the Argama, I believe. Silly man. Yep, the Samuel, just like that. To win, well, this battle match, we got a Sunner Almeyer. And the obvious way to do that is. Well, you know, don't let it tell get too low, yada yada. I believe there were dumb stuff, they're saying 12,000 health. Okay, who's got the scan? Goomy, eh? I'll just use the scan twice. Yeah, of course. Ah, I see, a pure brick wall, eh? And I failed. Shit beam saber. That sounds kind of funny. Okay, how strong is that saber? I mean, does it have the same health as the ones I fought oh so long ago? I think it's a bit weaker. Yeah, it is. Will game low level. Is X to that valor? As always, just as kick ass. Well, this valor, I'll make sure to take it down. 70 valor, eh? Let's get down, guys. Oh, sweet. It can fly now. That's right, it's beam rifle back, which I'll probably never use. Most importantly, it believes it can fly. It can, it believes it can touch the sky. I think about it every night and day. Spread my drugs and fly away. I believe I can drink oval tea, even though I don't, don't know what it tastes like because... <laughs> uh, damn you videos. You and your oval tea. Who are you there? Move on below, who also has Valor. Here. Move you there. Move the Hyakushiki Kai! Here. Move Mazinga Zeto! There. Move Jerome. Here. Move Magda Chugging Body! Forward. High move, high defense, good speed, powerful weapons. That doesn't sound like awesome. You're crazy.
sometimes I think the quality is better on my phone. My phone. And that's kind of sad to say. I actually think they're they are fairly similar. I wonder if there's ever a point where these videos had better quality. Quality doesn't bug me, of course. I'm just. Why do people think it's. don't like the quality? If it keeps up, will the game will die! <laughs> but don't worry, I'll ignore him. Is there nothing that can be done to stop this fighting? <laughs> Please, take it easy, we're in the middle of a battle here! <laughs> but it just keeps up! To hell, I'm telling you, we cannot give this mountain cycle up to them! I mean, the MP cannon is rather powerful. Oh wow, they're right there. They're rather close. Okay. Excel. Let the beating begin. Commencing ass kicking. We have the same HP. Engine room, could you enter full power? Hey, I'm the captain here. It's time for the one, two, bottle machine. Good damn it. Don't take your match for the moon race. <laughs> I'll stop, but me, the Iron Gear is invincible. It cuts it right pretty well. I'd even upgraded that thing, it's still that much of a tank. Pretty bitch, now to say. for a shootout. <laughs> Alright, let's do this! If I'm taking that directly, I'd be finished. They're in range, go! Attacks are all patterns, right? <laughs> wow! Not bad! Is it no way even existing this game, I wonder? Maybe it's just too awesome. You can make hands for massive damage right on standing. Oh well, no. <laughs> they don't have a hit rate. This is weird. Launch an attack on the tall geese tree. I think that's directly, I'd be finished. 
Third Ranch, go! Oh Your attacks aren't oh enough to hit the tall geese. So good to go. <laughs> and we can take quite a bit more than that. And you don't have valor yet, I don't have to worry about your SP as much. Eight of them, so don't worry about wasting them. I feel input. You should be able to handle it. I can use it in the air now. I know they aren't, but I'm not the same. Level up! Oops, wrong buttons. My avoid the direct hit. Here they come. Take this. You shouldn't estimate the Shakushiki Kai specs. I'll take you on, buddy. I am Kata. I think that's right there. Be finished. Here they come. Take this. Like you're no match for my singer. That tickles. And they give it armor or something. God, that's high defense. It's a higher than. Oh no, that's for. Did I think how ridiculous they are? Don't forget about Kureto! 
Dun 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 you won't get anywhere targeting greater. Fucked even to me a town. Oops, I screwed up. We are here, be strong. I am the curator, 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 Marcina. Born it up. Take it on the tag. Here they come. Take this. I'll show you the next one though, it's not continuing saying things. Tifa! Hey! Tifa! Come on! You're here so it's a parting word or two. Eh? Me? Well, then... Please. Promise me, promise me that you'll return. You must end this battle soon. This cannot do female voices. <laughs> uh. Anyway, bye.